What's up everybody, welcome back to another video. This video is a special one. It's one for you Japanese collectors as well as you guys who collect English products because not only is this gonna be a preview for Shining Fates and I'm gonna show you every single card that's gonna be in the English Shiny Vault, but I'm also gonna show you Japanese collectors my completed Shiny Star V Master Set. So I've got a um, folder here, Ultimate Guard, Zip Folio, 480 pocket, it folio and this thing is stacked i think there's only two spaces left in this folder so we're going to show you exactly what we've got so we've got the first first of all we've got the full uh, 190 card set of shiny star v and then i'm going to show you guys a shiny vault um, now most of these cards are best of cards you're going to see this in shining fates i think this is one of the few cards in this main set that you're going to get to see in shining fates but generally speaking, these cards were, as in Japan, every year we get a high class set. So these things are literally a best of the year's cards. Now, this is, there are a few exceptions, obviously, and those are going to be the amazing rare. So we've got Reshiram Amazing Rare, which is going to be in Shining Fates. And we have also got uh, this Kyogre here as well, which is going to be in Shining Fates as well. Um, I think there's a few other cards, like, um, for example, our friend Snom here, which you'll see an appearance in Shining Fates, as well as Rotom. But the majority of these cards are reprints in this set. The English set comprising of 72 cards is mainly going to be made up of cards that are from the Japanese uh, starter decks, some promos, and a few cards from this set as well. So there we go. Um, we have got uh, another card which I needed to show you guys actually, which is uh, Crobat VMAX, which is also going to make an appearance in Shining Fates, as well as the third amazing rare from this set, a Veltel. Amazing rare as well. Okay, so moving along, let's get through this. There's a few trainer cards, which again are new to this set which you will see in um, Shining Fates. But generally speaking, there's a few more here as well. Um, it's gonna be the stuff that we see here. So let's have a look at some of the new cards that you can expect to see in Shining Fates from the full art side of things. So we've got Coralis, League Trainers, uh, Bird Keeper, Piers Reprint, but a younger version of Piers obviously. Skylar's getting another uh, reprint as well. Ball Guy's making an appearance. Uh, Pokey Kid. Marnie is being omitted from Shining Fates. Uh, we don't know why. And then we have Chairman Rose again. Now, this is where things start to get exciting. So those of you who want to see all the shiny vault cards, all 104 baby shinies, as we call them, are in the set. So let's uh, start by looking at Rowlet onwards. So I'll let you guys have a look at each one as we go through. So as you can see, there is a common theme amongst this. Pretty much every card that's been um, released in this generation or new Pokemon that has made an appearance in this generation so far in the first year of Sword and Shield has pretty much got its own shiny card in the shiny vault. This card here, Suikun, saw the highest price in Japan amongst all of these baby shinies. And I knew it from when I first saw it, to be fair, the artwork is absolutely stunning and a lot of people were extremely interested in that particular one but as you can see like i said there are 104 of these baby shinies which every single one is gonna make an appearance in the shiny vault there's 122 cards in shining fates shiny vault uh, not all of the bigger V and VMAX make it into the set, but we will be seeing them because they will be part of promos. And I'll talk about those once we get to those. Uh, 
Now I know there has been some issues around production and around getting it shipped around the world. So Shining Fates is due out this month, February 2021. And I believe some people have already had ETB opened, which is why we've got the full set list. A big shout out to Pokey Guardian, uh, my good friend, Prima Lugia, who runs Pokey Guardian, has got an article up with every single Shining um, Fates card listed on there and where they've made their appearance in Japanese sets as well. So go and check that out on pokeguardian.com, which is where I have got my source list for making this video for you guys and giving you the information that I am. And this page, as you can see, wraps up the baby shinies and then we move on to the shiny Vs and better. So uh, let's have a quick look at what we've got. So Rillaboom V is definitely in the shiny vault as well as Rillaboom V Max. Eldegoss V will be in a special tin. So you won't see that in the set. Obviously we've already seen shiny Charizard V. This is gonna be the chase card. I think everybody's going to be trying to get hold of. Charizard VMAX, obviously. All of these are definitely in the shiny vault. Baltan, like Elder Gloss, is not going to be in the shiny vault. It is a tin promo. Toxtricity, Indeedy, these guys are all in the set. But Dragapult and Dragapult VMAX are not in the set. They are in a special box set from my understanding, not in a tin. We have got Phalanx and again Crobat makes an omission as well, won't be in the set. Grimmsnarl, Grimmsnarl VMAX, Ditto and Ditto VMAX are definitely in the shiny vault. Uh, Dovewall is in the shiny vault but again Cramorant V is a tin promo. And then we've got Eternatus V and Eternatus V Max gold cards, which are also in this set. We've already seen these two released in the premium um, trainer boxes, as well as a premium collection box. And then it's just the rest of my, oops, my, my Lexus playing up a bit. Um, and there we go, these are all the mirror foils or Shiny Star V. So those of you interested in the Japanese set, we have got these. Every single one of the main set has now been collected. And thank you to everyone who's contributed to helping me get this completed. And then we have got the Crobat V, which was omitted from the set, was a Japanese promo. So that's there as well. And we've got all 24 of the code cards that were like almost like a mini set essentially in the set as well so hope you guys have enjoyed this video so like i said um you will see um all the shiny baby shinies as well as all the big shinies in one form or another in shining fates hope you guys get some real good luck finding the set because i know a lot of people are having difficulty getting hold of products it's been heavily allocated so hopefully everyone gets a fair chance of getting some products and um, good luck finding your chase cards. Thank you so much for watching this video and I hope to see you guys soon. Take care, bye.
Yeah. <laughs>